Well, from one big dance to the next, plans for this year's high school proms have been up in the air for months. But since Governor Asa Hutchinson made the announcement about loosening up on COVID-19 restrictions, many school districts immediately decided to move forward with their dances. THP 11's Jordan Howington explains. Administrators here at Pulaski County Special School District have worked over the past two weeks to come up with a safe prom plan. We felt comfortable in making these decisions. PCSSD juniors and seniors will have a prom. It's one district among several in central Arkansas moving forward with the event that was abruptly canceled last year when the pandemic hit. To be able to give something back to these students who have been through so much this year, that, that sense of Normalcy without fully being normal was so important to us. And now prom dress shops are suddenly swarmed. We were so excited. Buffy's all the rage isn't complaining though. After being closed for eight months, taking a hard financial hit and not knowing if they'd be able to bounce back. This is my 20th year anniversary of being in business. I feel like if it would have hit me any sooner, we wouldn't have survived. Over 600 dresses left without love and nothing to fall back on. But since Governor Hutchinson's announcement on loosened restrictions, dress sales took off. Literally that afternoon, okay. the appointment started. So we still continue to go by COVID guidelines um, and we still are by appointment only. Jessica Duff with PCSSD says ultimately the district's decline in their own number of COVID-19 cases played a role in their decision to host its annual prom. Looking at our cases that um, have been reported through the ADH website, uh, we're doing significantly better than we anticipated. In Little Rock, Jordan Howington, THV 11 News. Jordan, thank you. Now your school's plans may vary, but PCSSD students should check with their individual school administrators for prom details. And remember, no matter what or where they are going to be held, students will be required to wear a mask.